How can we demonstrate how computers communicate with each other? The task can be difficult because computers communicate using complex equipment, cables, fibers and connections, routing their signals at the speed of light. Yet, by devising a communication network that uses a model train instead of a cable to transmit the picture's pixels as bits, from the computer you see on the left to the computer you see on the right, we can demonstrate the basic workings of digital communication, representation and storage, transmitters and receivers. The experiment you'll see was awarded a prize at the 2009 Wizards of Science Scientific Experiment Competition. The setup consists of a center computer that contains a small picture to be sent, depicting a stick figure of a human, thus demonstrating how we can digitize an image and how all digital images can be stored, processed and transmitted by a computer that uses this technique. A model train runs around a track, sending the picture bit by bit from the sender to the receiver. The sending computer is connected to a sensor that detects the passing of the train and the switch that controls a motorized junction. When the train passes through the sensor, the junction directs the train to one of two tracks. On the track corresponding to the picture's red pixels, a signaling device on top of the train rotates so that it will later on pass under the receiving computer's sensor. On the track corresponding to the picture's off pixels, the signaling device on the train rotates so that it will not pass under the receiving computer's sensor. The receiving computer is wired to two sensors. When a train passes from the train sensing sensor, a timer starts and the computer's software starts monitoring the pixel sensing sensor. When the train's signaling device passes under the sensor, the receiving computer draws a red pixel, otherwise it draws a black pixel. In this way we demonstrate how a picture or other data like music or text can be transmitted between two computers by digitizing it, that is converting it into discrete bits, and then transferring each bit from one computer to the next. We point out that in practice computers don't compute via a slow model train running on tracks, but at the speed of light. To communicate the bits, they manipulate the form of electrical current running through the wires, light running through fiber optic lines and electromagnetic waves zipping through the air. Whereas our model train requires 6 seconds to transfer one bit, a broadband internet connection at home can transfer 6 million bits in one second. Whereas our picture consists of 15 one-color pixels, the pictures we snap with our digital camera consist of 5 million multicolor pixels or more. Thus, storing or transferring a single picture or music piece involves tens of millions of bits, but the underlying principles are exactly the same.
The signaling device also demonstrates the way computers store data. Its orientation signifies a red or black pixel. Similarly, our computer's hard disk contains billions of tiny magnets whose orientation stores a single bit. Light reflected on it is used to read a bit. Similarly, a CD or DVD drive will reflect light on the disk to read each bit stored on it.